What's going on guys? Welcome back to another video. I know it's been a good minute since my last video, but as most of you guys know, I'm moving into my new place and I'm actually in it right now and I've been busy unpacking and pretty much furnishing the place up. So I went to Ikea maybe four or five times already. So I know that most of you guys are finishing up your CASP applications, finishing up secondaries, and so I wanted to give you guys just my application timeline for when I applied last year. Here we go. Don't forget you can connect with me on Instagram at Fresh Prince of Healthcare. I post a lot of cool things on my Instagram page that probably is useful and cool for you guys to see as well. I also am losing my voice. I lost it a little bit a couple days ago watching the NBA Finals Game 4 when the Cavs won the game. We were at Buffalo Wild Wings and I was cheering really loudly and I lost my voice probably in 15 minutes. So bear with me as my voice is going to be fluctuating in and out. So I'm always asked when did I submit my application, when did I get verified, when did I receive my first interview, rejection, and for me last year when I applied, I submitted my CASPA application on June 8th and I was verified on June 13th, five days after I submitted my CASPA. And I was fortunate to be verified within five days, which is not too bad. But it's also crazy because some people this cycle and last cycle, they were verified the same day. And usually if they're really busy, it will take between a week and a week and a half to two weeks. But I haven't heard of anyone that had to wait the full two weeks. Usually a week, within a week or a week and a half is the normal time that CASPA will take to verify your application as long as you have all the information inputted correctly. And a common question that I see very often is how long does it take for CASPA to verify? And again, like I mentioned, it really varies and depends on how many applicants are submitting at the same time as you and how many people at CASPA are available to verify applications since it is a tedious process. Again, it can range from the same day up to two weeks. So after being verified on June 13th, I received my first interview invite through email on July 15th and this interview was scheduled for September. And all my other interviews after that came within you know, a month and a half or a month of each other after that. So they were spread out, which wasn't too bad. So I did have to schedule two interviews pretty much on the same weekend. One was Friday, Saturday, and one was on Monday. So my first interview was in August, I believe, and my last interview was in January. In terms of the response time from the programs, I got my decisions within two weeks to a month, and for the programs I were waitlisted at, I had to wait quite a bit of time. I had to wait till the end of their interview process to find out pretty much if I you know, was waitlisted or if I was given a spot. In terms of rejections, I received them pretty much about a month after I submitted my application and just received them sporadically throughout the year. And I didn't receive my last one until maybe two or three weeks ago, which is super late. <laughs> like I always preach, every applicant is different and unique in their own path and their application process. So don't compare yourself to other people, other applicants that might already be getting interviews or have already been accepted. It really depends on yourself as an applicant and your application and how schools view you. So try your best not to compare yourself to others as hard as that may be, but I promise you it'll help you not to stress as much. These are things that are out of your control and things that you, you know, should keep an eye on but not stress over. As long as you receive at least one interview or a few interviews, you're putting yourself in a great position to succeed. As most of you guys know, I start my orientation in less than two weeks. So I'm super excited. I'm just trying to get settled in at my new place and get comfortable before I start studying. Again, I apologize for being so MIA on YouTube. I want to put out a video at least once a week, maybe at the end of the week, just recapping what I did, how I'm feeling, and just reflecting on my experiences. And hopefully that'll shed some light for you guys. And if you are finishing up your application or you're going through the application process, don't stress over things that are out of your control. Just relax, enjoy the process. Please give this video a like if this was helpful. It helps the channel grow. And honestly, this channel would be nothing without you guys and your support. So thank you guys. Don't forget to be like my blood type. Be positive. I'll see you guys in the next one. Peace.